I don't know if I just recorded this or not. <laughs> Mama Long here. Okay, I caught myself cutting it off, and I guess it just turned on. I have my, uh, looked it up, it's a papyrus or umbrella plant. It's a pond plant, so it definitely likes water. So, good thing I have a humidifier here. But I think I'm just going to set it up against the, my bedroom curtain and let it be a backdrop because it's going to get tall. So just let it be a backdrop to all my plants. But uh, yeah, I like it. She's a pretty one. Yeah, I, tr I, tr I didn't, I just upped the pot size a little and I couldn't get dirt around her. So I put dirt at the bottom of the pot and just started using a fork to dig on the top and kind of push that down in there. But she's in there and then I watered her real good. So yeah, I had to tie her up because I just put her back. So I didn't want her to just fall all over the place, which she's going to do because that's how they grow. Uh, but yeah, I'm going to put her as the backdrop to my curtain in my bedroom in here. And she should be real pretty. Real pretty. <laughs> yes, sir. She should. Well, it's time for me to get to, oh my gosh, to all of this stuff. Look at my Aubrey's back there. My, you know, I split those up. So that's one plant, but I got two out of it. And I gotta get to my, uh, what is my custard? My um, viewer told me this was a Rapidophora de Curcii. I got it. This is stunning. I've got to fix this one. See, I got a baby coming on there. I gotta fix this quick, cause she's a runner, but a different kind. See, her vine is so big. Look at that. I gotta get her. Oh my gosh. I gotta fix her. Yeah, I'll get her today. But anyway, uh, umbrella palm, papyrus, <laughs> Cleopatra, just a beautiful plant. Okay? Bye. Mama Long. Like and subscribe.